Here is your step three, flip to pour. So what do you need to know about this flip to pour? Firstly, what we're doing is I'm doing a flip and I'm catching it in reverse grip, okay? Reverse grip is this and it's obvious, it's reversed. So what you wanna know about this trip is once you throw it, it's gonna come right back to your hand. So this is a good little exercise to get you ready. It's just doing this flip right back to your hand. Funny enough, when you somebody's never done flare ever before, the first thing they wanna do is this. I don't know what it is, but uh, that's what everyone does the first time. So this should be easy if, this, if you're just starting for you. But the difference is, when you are able to do that comfortably, <coughs> excuse me, you wanna make sure you catch it right above your target as so. So just a slight variation there. Once it's done pouring, I cut it over the top and I just brought it back to myself. Nothing too complicated or fancy about the way I finished it, but it's more about catching it right where you're gonna pour it is what you need to work on. Put all those steps together and you have completed your three-step prerequisite to get you ready eventually to get into the numbers of your exhibition flare. So make sure that that looks crisp and uh, we're gonna do another one, another three-step right after. Okay, so I'll see you back here for that when you're ready.